in this week's discussion talking about uh, the justice system in America. So, for the prompt here, it's seven times as many people um, is, are incarnated in U.S. as similar nations. Do we have more criminals? Is it, and it justifiable for our criminal system? Yes or no? I think we don't necessarily have more criminals. Um, we have... I don't know, like, the statistics. I would say we have about average, maybe a little above average for murderers or actual people that are doing uh, real harm compared to a lot of the uh, drug-related incidences for jail or the smaller things that can still get you away for a long time or a longer time than you should have to. Give you a new name for yourself, a new identity pretty much that you don't need to go by just because of your small offense. So what I'm meaning here is like if you get caught with weed or another drug, I don't know how bad it is for others compared to um, weed, but you can get I think 20 years for so much or more of course and it's a real issue considering you're not a criminal just because you smoke in some states it's legal some states it's not compared to um, like if you hijack a car or, uh, break in break in and enter um, theft you know stuff that uh, escalates higher than smoking can uh, get the same punishment as smoking in a general sense so I don't believe we have a more dangerous criminal society is a way to say it we have more criminals based on what our justice says they are uh, compared to what laws we might have versus what other laws might be uh, in state for say Europe or other nations for instance, uh, we have so many laws, drug laws, um, vehicle laws, that can get you put in jail for a very extended time, whereas I would say other nations aren't as strict on those same things. Like here, I don't think it's justifiable to uh, put so many people in jail or in prison, put them away for a while for the smaller things. Like I have a friend that just got expelled out of uh, his high school for having literally the amount of uh, marijuana on him that you would find like in a trash can if you just happen to be looking in a trash can. You wouldn't find much at all. Um, say somebody just like put like a dust of it in there. That's pretty much the equivalent of what he had and he almost went to jail for it. He got in serious amounts of trouble had to go to therapy, community service, few courts, and all this stuff. I've had another friend go through the same thing, except on a worse condition, for something that he didn't even do. And I've had one of my friends go through something with uh, driving, where they have a court date, because they're driving on an ex extended or uh, expended license, where they don't really necessarily have a license anymore, just because they have gotten it uh, taken away or revoked so many times, but they still have to go to work. They still have to live their daily lives, and they can't necessarily be counted, um, can't be held accountable for having to get to work. And, you know, it's not e the easiest thing to walk 15 miles to your job. So I don't think it's justifiable to have so many people that we have in jail. Of course, for the murderers and stuff, I do believe that that's justifiable. Uh, so if you have any questions or think what I'm saying is true or not, let me know. Thank you guys.